Hello, my name is Blake Patterson, and welcome to Afro Reviews. On the latest episode of the classic series, I examine floating clouds. The following quote is from the final card. So short is the life of a flower, yet how many hardships it suffers. This quote is essentially what Mikio Narus grasped in Floating Clouds. In post-World War II Japan, a lonely woman attempts to find satisfaction with a man who does not treat her equally. The film is not merely a portrait of desperation for the woman, but it epitomizes a sense of tragedy amid the nation. Floating Clouds is an allusion to this bleak era, yet Narus is careful in his execution of the melodrama. The beauty of Narus's craftsmanship is how he restrains the emotions and meanings of his characters until the right moments. Narus does not compose a simplistic, clunky message to tell his audience how to think. The thematic communication is in the facial expressions and movement of the cast, specifically, and I may butcher this name, Hadiko Takamine. When tragedy erupts, the subtle power of Narusa's direction and Takamine's performance create a moving experience. It is fair for anyone to cry in a few moments during floating clouds because the conflicts are so psychologically authentic. Narus shoots the film in gorgeous yet raw black and white, and it gives floating clouds the feeling of a lost artifact. Like Sancho the Bailiff, floating clouds was one of the unsung triumphs from the 50s. They deserve universal recognition for their honesty and humility. Thank you for watching this video. Have a great night.